evening, everybody. I'm Brent Musburger, and welcome to our NCAA championship game. For North Carolina, and a forward, number 52, a 6'9", 219-pound junior from Gastonia, North Carolina, James Worthy. For Georgetown at center, number 33, a 7-foot, 220-pound freshman from Cambridge, Massachusetts, Pat Ewing. Number 23, a 6'5", 189-pound freshman from Wilmington, North Carolina, Michael Jordan. For Georgetown at a guard, number 21, a 6'3", 170-pound senior from Gastonia, North Carolina, Eric Floyd. And for North Carolina at a guard, the head coach of the Georgetown Hoyas is John Thompson. The head coach of the North Carolina Tar Heels is Dean Smith. The 1982 NCAA championship is underway. Hancock off to Eric Smith. Back out to Hancock. This is Fred Brown who played so well, and that went over Louisville. Sleepy Floyd, over 2,000 points in his career at Georgetown. The all-time leading scorer has to get it back out to Brown, and North Carolina plays a tough man-to-man defense into Ewing. Perkins letting Ewing handle it, shooting that fadeaway jumper. Now here comes the full court. Been shooting very well in this tournament, extremely well. 83 to present to be exact, and that'll be goaltending. But I'll tell you, Ewing is up around that cylinder. Well, he is, and that was not a wise play on his part. James Worthy will not be intimidated with that type of goaltend because the ball was obviously on the way down. Pat Ewing was right under the basket. Boy, does that shot great boys. John Thompson has worked with his young club all year to come up with that, and Ewing with another steal. That's two turnovers against North Carolina, and Ewing is playing remarkably well. Both teams are very tight. Here's Ewing again, and he has four points. He was not getting that shot against Louisville on Saturday. Already he's moved in and was told in that time by Fred Brown. Here's James Worthy, and that'll be another goaltending. Patrick Ewing is standing right under the basket. John Thompson's trying to work the officials a little bit here, but you can't block those kind of shots against a Worthy or Perkins when you're standing right under the basket because their ball's going to come down quickly, and there you see it. Boy, is he getting up there, though. Doherty gets it into Jimmy Black. Nice pass, baseline, Jordan, and we're going to have goaltending again. That's three goaltending calls on Pat Ewing. That's a very significant call right there. What are they going to do with Ewing when he goes up there to try to swat these shots away? Now, he has to be a little bit more careful because if they're going to call it tight, looking like goaltending most of the time, which they have been, that ball had hit off the backboard and was coming down. 13-22 to go first half. Tough shot. Boy, off balance still gets it. There's another example. Nice pass to Perkins. Ewing got a piece of it. Perkins, Ewing again, and that'll be a score. Goaltending call. That's an excellent call. John Thompson really trying to work these officials. Here's Lloyd Black. Let's him get by, and he can't let him get that step. Lloyd took advantage of it. Maybe he saves it. Again, James Worthy. Almost impossible to block a shot. That's what I expected. And he's a steady influence. Sleepy Floyd, and Floyd, who was three of 11 Saturday, is shooting the odd lights out right now. He has three field goals. It's 16-12 Georgetown. Spriggs asked to come out. He's a little tired right now. He had the great game Saturday as well. Here's Worthy. There shows his range. Worthy with eight points. Worthy this year, averaging only 50. First half, Floyd is three of four from the field in this game. Here he is, he's gonna pop another one. Oh, he's on tonight. Four of five for the consensus All-American. Gastonia Perkins brings it out. Black, here's Worthy. He's the bread and butter man right now. Sensational turn because he had Jones coming for this game tonight. Worthy, and oh, that's five of them. Yeah, that'll, that'll bring John Thompson up. Is that five goals in? That's five. Now, pretty soon, you got to ask a young man at 18, are you going to keep it up? There he is, Pat Ewing, getting it on the way down. Yeah. trap. Gordy tipped up and in by Worthy. I should say slammed in by Worthy. Okay, we're going to see that last play by James Worthy. Excellent position to rebound. Here's the block out, not quite there. Worthy grabs it and then just forces it down into the rim. In there. Trying to give his starter some breathing room. And oh, yeah. With that beautiful arching shot, has 16 points in the game. Dean Smith, and let him put up the shot. 
Ewing, that's the way he started the ball game. Right there at that spot, and that gives the Hoyas a one-point lead. Oh! Against oh. Ewing, rebound, Jordan. He changed right hands and hit it. Left right hand. Slowly, now he has the ball. He's got it again. Worthy, the consensus All-American has 18 points in the game. Carolina, and just a little over two minutes left in this first half. Floyd Ball, oh, beautiful. He, he was... Nice play, rebound, Ewing, and he's fouled. Good foul down the ball. An opportunity to shoot in this game. And Ewing hit both of them to pick up the ball. There's a reach-in by Floyd. Big turnover. Eric Smith off the screen. Ewing's got the lob. There it is. You can see the foul difficulty at the halftime, Mark. Look at it. It's been Gastonia and North Carolina against each other. 18 and 10. That relation goes down. Red Brown to Ewing. Ball on the play. Where are these down and up? 4-33, the Hoyas. Michael Jordan. Oh, what a shooter he is. He had a feeling the ball. Eric Smith. Ewing follow chips. Ewing again. Ewing again. Ewing again. That play will be remembered in this game. One here earlier, and he's going to try another one, and he's fouled. That basket. He went in, Billy, and shot 82 extra shots after practice. First ball club, Lagarde was hurt, Davis was hurt, Ford was hurt. Jones is one of three. The one for him, the other is all for two. Steal by Worthy. Watch the Ewing. Ball. He intimidated him. Follow beautiful by Michael Jordan. Back door. Wait before. No foul. Worthy went down too far behind and got North Carolina in that delay game. Squad's going to take care of that problem. Smith, though, recovers. And the tip by Ewing. Oh, what an effort by this Georgetown team. Perkins, he's going to challenge Ewing. Blocked. Ewing got a piece of it, but Worthy is there. Well, one, two punch. North Carolina into Ewing. Perkins tries to stop him, but to no avail. He can put the ball. Georgetown with the lead. They can add to it. Ewing's going to do that. It'll count, and he's fouled by Sam Perkins. Put target keeping his hands up. Perkins goes with him, and when he flicks that wrist down, he comes down with it. John Thompson has brought him along very, very carefully. And closer to the defensive pressure. Floyd is open. Yeah, I tell you, it's just amazing what he's doing. He Look lost out. the handle. The basketball count on us. Foul is going to go on Sleepy Floyd. Down. Worthy gets it. Sleepy Floyd seen this play before. There's no way he's going to stop James Worthy on that dunk. And listen to the fans in here. They see it on the big screen over again, and they're just... Play for Worthy. It's a one-point game. Jordy to Jordan, spreads out on him. Good coverage defensively. He still hit it. Oh, what presence of mind. Standing on the boards. Jordy, beautiful pass to Worthy. Floyd, that was a reach in by Jordan. Jordan is playing superb basketball to Worthy. Brown not known for the outside shooting ability. There's a steal by Worthy. He'll show some speed here. And he's fouled. That foul will go. You know, so basketball is a team game. He's short again. Tipped up. Almost caught very well. Remember this. The next hell ball would go to Georgetown. Is Jordan on the oh, What a layup. He put that ball up about 12 feet. Smith, they don't want him shooting. He's not that good a shooter from outside. Ewing's going to try it. He's oh. Point ball game with two and a half minutes to go. 23 points for Pat Ewing. Saw him. I figure Sleepy Floyd's going to go for the jumper. Is he ever? Fake beautifully once, twice, gets a roll, and the Hoyas lead by one. What a play by Sleepy Floyd. 52 seconds. He was going to take it. He's a money player, a double fake. Had a guy in front, a guy behind, and Georgetown getting some nice bounces now. Ewing's did the same thing. So much time. Jordy to Black. The time, 18. Shot, Jordan, Michael Jordan, 14 seconds. Red Brown, look for, look for Sleepy Floyd. Look. Oh, he threw it to the wrong man. He threw it to Worthy. It's over, it's over. He's fouled by Eric Smith. Fred Brown, somehow or another, threw the ball into the hands of James Worthy. where they could have used the timeout. And Georgetown loses it. North Carolina has won the 1982 NCAA championship.